Hello, welcome to Graphing Parabolas on the CAS Basics with the teacher. Uh, to start with, we're going to start a graph screen. I'm going to add the graph. And see, uh, we can type our uh, parabola in here. This is the quadratic equation. Yep, and we can see it just automatically graphs it there. Want to have a look at the equation again? We can just press tab. Okay. Now, uh, we've now entered that, we've graphed it, and we've actually stored it as f1 of x. So remember that name. And then we can go back to create a calculator, and we can do some things. So again, we've already defined it. So we've defined f1 of x. Now we can factor it. And we can just type factor, or we can go menu, algebra. So this time we want to solve. So we'll solve. Uh, we'll solve for x and make it equal to 0. So these, we have our x-intercepts. Uh, now if we want our y-intercept, we can just do f1 of 0. And now we want our turning point. We can use complete the square. So menu, algebra complete the square f1 of x want to complete the square using x and so we can see the uh, the turning point will be x is three quarters and y is negative 49 on eight okay so now we could use that to graph we can also go back going control and then that right arrow that goes between the screens now uh, we can do some analysis in the graph screen so we can press menu and then analyze graph so first of all we might want zeros that means the, the x-intercepts so we pick the lower bound and the upper bound between that we can see there's a zero for each of them we have to do that so menu analyze graph zero lower bound that means to the left of it and then to the right so that will give us our x-intercepts uh, now we uh, we might want uh, our minimum or maximum that'll give us our turning point so there's the minimum lower bound again and then upper bound and you can see uh, we've got our turning point now uh, what else could we do we can go menu trace graph trace and then we can actually just use our arrows to move the graph uh, move a point throughout and give us a number of different points all right now this is really good but if if uh, the answers are irrational like square roots on the graph screen you'll only get uh, approximations so you'll definitely be better off doing that in the calculator screen well i hope that this helps this is uh graphing parabolas with the teacher please let me know if you'd like any more videos